In this video, we're going to figure out how many seconds there are in one year from converting from units of years over to units of seconds. Now, in order to make this conversion, we first have to convert from units of years to units of days. And then what we can do is we can convert from units of days to units of hours, and then from hours to units of minutes, and then from units of minutes, we can convert to units of seconds. Now, in order to convert from years over to seconds, we first need to know the unit relationships between years and days, days and hours, hours and minutes, and then minutes and seconds. But you already know this information. You already know that one year has 365 days. You also know that one day has 24 hours. And you also know that one hour equals or has 60 minutes. And you also know that one minute equals or has 60 seconds. So we're going to use these unit relationships to convert between units of years and units of seconds. And in order to do that, we're going to begin with one year. And then we're going to multiply it by a conversion factor. In this case, our conversion factor is going to take us from units of years over to units of days. So we said that one year equals or has 365 days. Notice that this unit of year cancels out with this unit of year, and the unit we're left with is unit of days. Now the next step is to multiply by a conversion factor that takes us from days over to units of hours. So for example, you know that one day has 24 hours, and what you should see is this unit of day cancels out with this unit of day, and we're left with unit of hours. So now we need to multiply by a conversion factor that takes us from units of hours over to units of minutes, and you know that one hour has 60 minutes. And notice that this unit of hour cancels out with this unit of hour and you're left with units of minutes. Now you need to multiply this by a conversion factor that takes you from units of minutes over to units of seconds. So you know that one minute is equal to 60 seconds. And again, notice this unit of minute cancels out with this unit of minute. Now notice that the only unit left over is the unit of a second. So we've made the conversion between units of years and units of seconds. And now the only thing that remains is to multiply 365 by 24 by 60 by 60 to get the number of seconds in one year. And when you multiply this out, you get 31,536,000 seconds. Now another way to think about this is that one year has or equals 31,536,000 seconds in it. 